Hello peeps, Dragon here. In my previous Let's Play episode I started building on the salvage ship and today I would like to introduce you to the swipe. The idea behind the swipe is the perfect combination between agility and salvage power. So let me explain. If you would build a ship which could eat such a roid just by pointing at it and activating um, this ship would be so big like so big and so heavy that you would lose a lot of time traveling in between asteroid fields and turning and stuff like that so what i wanted is a light ship which is able to still eat a roid in a special manner actually by swiping over it. Let's try that. We are floating like here, pointing at one end, starting the beam and then I'm just going to get us going in one direction, a little bit slower so we can eat everything. And then we basically just point the beam somewhere in the middle and the swipe will basically then eat the roid from one side to the other. It is downloadable at starmate.net, link will be in the description. Maybe a little bit slower on those really sick parts. Ooh, that was too much. Come on, get going. Anyway, you get the idea. Basically, by swiping over your... Um... By the way, we have another camera for that. By swiping over the um... right, you pretty much eat it in maybe not one go, but a few goes. And you are still very fast mining them, but you are not in a heavy ship that has trouble turning and has trouble, uh, you know, getting to the next void field. So, yeah, we just mined this one. And as you saw, I mean, this this is all real in-game time, you know. So, that's how this thing eats roids. And still, you know, we activate the afterburner, we go like here, defense mechanism, and then, where is another right field? Let's see. Somewhere around here. Over there! There are white ones. I like white ones. And then we go there with, uh, like, 100... Yeah, we need to stop already again. <laughs> Let's see how, how, how the accelerate... Oh, I didn't, I didn't adjust. Let me quickly thrust. Yeah. Like, something like that. Maybe. Now it needs to calibrate, 12 seconds to go. So it's under heavy load, really? I don't think so. Let's, let's get over here. Stop it. Yeah. 240. So actually this thing has a... Um, let's quickly stop here. Oh, stop. Stop. This ship has a thrust to mass ratio of 2 to 1. And yeah, I pretty like the outcome. Um, interior wise, let me quickly... I'm sitting here, that's okay. So we have a um, transporter here, gravity, and uh, radar jammer, you know, faction module. Here are your overdrive, dun dun dun. Bed with personal storage, your computer. This is the um, storage where the salvage beams basically put their stuff. Uh, microwave, uh, you know oven, some seating area here, little window at the side, and here we get to the, um, that's the, right, 
the airlock like basically you enter here here is the air to the outside thing so we are free to get in here but not free to go outside yet and here we have a little you know private area throne and um, you know stuff you might need every now and then like get a heal perfect and um, yeah if you want to get out you should put your helmet on then wait for the pressure rising and then this airlock opens puts you out of gravity and you can float around here yeah that's the ship thanks for watching please leave a like if you liked it and see you guys next time bye